I'm D.H. McNabb. I grew up in Tampa, Florida. Right now I'm in my, my thesis year at school and so I'm kind of trying to accumulate what it is that I do and to me glass is a collaborative process. You work with people, you learn from people, so I kind of learned through like an apprentice type relationship and then um, through assisting people and then through also what I've gotten to do here at Corning and also abroad with Corning through Glass Lab which is gaffing artists and designers work. And then kind of taking all those ex um, experiences and then putting my own kind of twist on them through my own work. The first thing I did was uh, basically the raw state of glass is called batch, where it's just soda, sand, and uh, calcium carbonate, just to name a few. And basically sprinkled that onto a plate into a format of like a three by five note card. I like to work with formats that are readily kind of, um, or obscurely standard measurements, like a, a piece of A4 paper, 11 by eight and a half, or a three by five note card. And rolling that up and then letting the batch kind of do what it does or cook, but it bubbles up on these kind of regular clear forms. That was kind of the first thing. And then um, another thing in these transferences of paper, I've been playing with paper airplanes. Uh, my father was in the military, United States Air Force, and he taught me how to fold planes. So a couple of years ago, I made a portrait of him where I folded up a paper airplane and then I folded up a glass one just to kind of mimic that gesture. I've also been um, working with uh, making goblets and stemware, but kind of making them to the extent that they almost seem somewhat machined. And from there, I've been playing with iterations. And the last thing I do, I've been working with these voyeur-like forms, and I think they would probably have started from a scientific interest in wormholes, but then also just simply looking into a glass of beer as the beer goes. Um, you know, from the glass down your throat, it's kind of seeing that pouring like void. And so these white forms are kind of have that, and I mirror the interior. So you kind of get um, the light and perspective gets changed. So those are the, those are the things I work on tonight.